say it. Doggy bag. A doggy bag is 90 bucks. A tea bag is 50. But I have to. Alright, man. You know what I'm saying? It's your boy Juan out here. You feel me? I'm out here getting the day started type shit. You feel me? Drinking. Stress, you know what I mean? I got a lot of shit going on, bills I gotta pay, you know, stuff I gotta make happen. I just got an eviction letter the other day saying I'm gonna get kicked out. So it's a, it's a lot of shit I gotta do, you feel me, to get up on my shit. So we gonna see if I could sit here and talk to Angel, see if you could put me on, you feel me? And as I'm going out the room and shit, I'm going to the living room. So, you know, I'm sitting here thinking. Yo, Angel. Yeah, just a person I wanted to see, bro. Like, it's a lot of shit I got going on type shit. Like, you feel me? You able to send, uh, get one of your boys to send me some shit so I could sell it, you know what I mean? So I could really start making shit. I'm trying to get in the game, you feel me? Because I know I've been out the game for so long, but I got to get back in there, man. I got to make this money. Yeah, man, what I could do is I could have my boys come and drop it off and you go sell it, you feel me? And whatever you make, I'll let you keep all that, you feel me? So I'm over here in the crib, you feel me? Got my laptop on, got the TV on type shit. Here's my little comfortable piece place, you feel me? My girl, she probably in the kitchen cooking for me. You know what I'm saying? We're going to have that shit good. Uh, got my Sprite on the side, you feel me? My little weed dish. Oh, where I put the bud, the little buds of it out. So you know what I'm saying. So I'm walking outside real quick. Going outside to light my blunt up. Cause you know how I am, man. I gotta have my blunt. So I'm over here smoking that. Feel me? That shit good. No cap. So I'm just enjoying this beautiful, you know what I mean, peaceful day. You hear the birds out here, all types of shit, the waves, the ocean. It's beautiful out. Definitely had to switch up my drip a little bit, you feel me on y'all, had to show y'all how it is. Hey yo, Nick, you good bro? I heard you got locked up and shit like that. Yeah bro, I got locked up, but I... You know what I mean? I did what I had to do and I ended up getting out type shit. The bomb was like 50k. Damn, 50k, nigga? Yeah, 50k for me to get out. Well, I'm glad you out. Just stay low, nigga. Stay off the radar, cuz we we'll need you going back. You feel me? I hopped up in my main back Mercedes. As I'm going over here, you feel me? I'm going over here to. Do my little business cut. Um, there you go. Be safe. How you doing? Yep. Thank you. What's up, my boy? What's up? Alright, man. There you go. Yeah, bro. I just wanted to see how you making out, though. You good? <laughs> Yeah, I'm good. I'm just back out here doing my thing. Yeah, I dropped it off, you feel me? So just make sure you don't fuck up and stay alert all times out of cops. I got you, bro. <gasps> yeah, the cops have been out here wildin', bro. I ain't gonna lie to you. But be safe. All right, my boy. So look, I'm over here driving. Good. Making sure that everything good. I'm about to go to the corner store real quick, get some blunt bills, you know what I'm saying? Maybe buy me some liquor. Probably a Hennessy day today. Get some Hennessy. Hey yo, what's up, buddy? Yeah, let me get like five blunt bills and a uh, Hennessy bottle. So I pulled up to my main spot, you feel me? Where I go. Get over here. There you go. Yeah, you see. Hey, gracias. There you go. How you doing? Hello. Uh, All right. Thank you. Like there you go. Yeah, no problem. Thank you. Good. How about you? All right. So I pulled up to Franklin crib. You feel me? He texted me and said he had had some money for me. You feel me? 
Which I appreciate, bro, because bro be looking out. Wow. Go up in here. It's a quick 100k on the bed. You feel me? Left for me. So I'm going to grab that. You feel me? And then I'm going to head out. <clears throat> I'm gonna go back to the crib because I gotta change and stuff because uh, Angel want me to go to his crib and whatnot. It's a beautiful crib, though, by the way. Good mansion. Yeah, bro. Just come over here. Yeah, we having a big ass meeting. Everybody else coming. Don't be late, nigga. Yeah. Yeah, we got business to discuss. And, you know, about the work prop proposition I got for you. Yeah. Alright, man. Yeah, girl, like, feel me? Of course, I appreciate you. Like, you did. You feel me? You was with me through thick and thin. Like, time I was broke to now. Like, you really a real bitch for that. Like, you minds, you feel me? So, come here. I'm going to walk you to the car, you feel me? Got about 100K that I want you to just go shopping today on you. Get you some shit, you know what I mean? Keep looking good for me later on tonight. You already know what's going down, you heard? But, yeah, let me walk you to the car, baby. How you like that? How you like your Audi? I made sure I got it for you because I know you like your Audis. Yeah, boss. I'm here to sell my Mercedes and shit, okay? Well, before we get into business and stuff, I need to grab the keys. I need to go in there and make sure everything good. Do a check on it and stuff like that. And when I get done that, I come back to you and I run the numbers back. Is it another car that you're looking for? Yeah, you want a 2023 Dodge Charger Red Eye Wide Body, correct? Okay, let me see what I have out here. In a minute. First, I'm going to go in your car. Do that little check. You know what I'm saying? Stuff like that. See what's up with it. Alright, so we got the hood open. Looking at the engine. Okay. Engine, engine looks good, stuff like that. The inside look good, no scratch, no nothing. Okay. And this is a 2023. All right, boss. So we did the check and stuff like that. Um, your trade value of the car is over 100k. Would you like to put that toward the Dodge Charger Red Eye Wide Body? Okay. Let me go out here. Let me just get the ID let me get the numbers for it, the ID numbers for the car stuff like that you know put this in the system uh you got the second spare keys for that Mercedes you got and here are the new keys for the red eye the black one and the red one so I'm over here in my Hellcat you feel me I finally went and got the Hellcat man I think it's beautiful. Beautiful car, man. Beautiful, beautiful. Like, I love this car. It sounds amazing. So, as I'm going back, I'm parking it up. I'm probably about to go to the crib and get dressed and stuff so I can go over Angel's crib to get discussion. Today, the big day. Let me lock it up. Alright. So, I went and got dressed, took a shower and stuff. You know, I got the 11s on with the white pants and the white tee. Yeah, I'm on my way, bro. Yeah, just getting ready and shit like that before I dip. All right, my boy, I'll, I'll see you when I get there. All right, one. So, you know, I took the, took the red eye out on the highway because, you know, I wanted to test it. This guy here in the Franklin crib. So I'm about to back up. So 
you feel me as I'm, as I'm doing my thing, you feel me? I'm going in here. Yeah, alright, so now I got everybody in here, man. I want to let y'all know, man. Every last one of y'all is like my family. I got my girl by my side, that been by my side. I got Rhea, I got Nick, and now I got you, Juan, so... I expect a lot coming from you, Juan, just because you're new to the family and stuff. Um, I still will have to test like how your loyalty is and stuff like that. We cannot be having people a part of our family if they like snitching or getting caught up or you know what I'm saying. We don't play that shit. It will be consequences if we find out you snitched or you was on some shit or whatever. Like it will be consequences. At the same time, Nick, I know you was locked up and shit like that, bro. I told you that day after I seen you, you need to be more careful. Especially with, you know what I'm saying, you getting locked up. You feel me? And, babe, like, you already know I run shit down. You run shit down, too. Keep doing your thing. But, one, in a little bit, I'm going to need you to come into the office with me. Because we got to discuss some personal shit. And then I need your signature on some papers. If that's cool. But, yeah, B, like I said, you always been by my side, so I appreciate you, so come over here dancing with my girl and shit, you feel me, she looking good as hell, thick, you know what I mean, I had to hit her with the moves, my boy Nick, I don't know why he just standing there, <laughs> he probably zoned out, you know, he was in that prison for like a good couple of days, so... Um, he trying to snap out of that little fixture, that little mindset he got where he just like standing, looking around, sitting, absorbing. But come on, ma. Yeah, we're going to go upstairs. We're going to handle some shit real quick, you know what I mean? Big boy shit. Need you to sign some papers, so since you're a part of this team with us and shit, and our family, you feel me? We're going to get you right. So, you know, since you working for me now and stuff like that, feel me? What I'm going to do is, uh, I'm going to give you your first 200K, you feel me? You take this 200K if you want to save it or if you want to use it for whatever, that's yours. I need you to sign right here, right here, right here, and right here. And after you sign right here, you sign that you work for me. If you be on funny shit, I will take and collect, you know, the shit I gave you back in for return. If you do anything shady, fucked up, whatever the case may be, then I have the right to feel me and do what I gotta do. But with that being said, welcome to the family. So, as I'm over here, you know what I'm saying, going up in my drone. I'm over here driving. So I'm in the SRT. This thing is beautiful too. Got this in on 30s. So we just got here. I need to talk to the mechanic about my one car, man. My. Uh, 2023 track hall. See how that's making out. Cause I see it in there. See the hood up. So I know he's still working on that shit. Cause there was a couple things wrong when I got this shit. I don't know. I guess it was me. Uh, malfunction shit. Yeah, boss. How my track hall doing? Yeah, boss. Your track hall. Your track hall. You should be getting that at the end of the week. We're just running a couple tests on it, making sure everything good. Um. 